Wine Class Philippines. Good day. Welcome to Math Class. Today, we are going to study about translation of mathematical phrases into verbal phrases. Useful tip to translate the statement into algebraic symbol and vice versa. Algebra is sometimes defined as the science of signs and symbols. Hence, solution of most mathematics problems depend upon the language of algebra by using the various signs, symbols, and notations in algebra. One of the most important aspects in solving problems in algebra is a working knowledge of the ability to translate the statement in algebraic symbols. Thus, one has to develop this ability in order to represent word problem into mathematical statement using algebraic symbols. A knowledge of constant and variable alongside with symbols of relations and operations will facilitate translation of verbal phrases into mathematical phrases. The symbol of operations and relations with their corresponding meaning are as follows. First, we have the minus or negative sign. The cross is plus or positive. The x is multiply. The line with two dot is divide. Two lines together is equal. Two line with a slash is not equal. This lines that are swirl is equivalent to. Three lines means identical. Three lines and a slash means not identical. Plus and minus below means plus or minus. This signs like a triangle and a slash means it's less than or equal. The other one is greater than, next is greater than or equal to, and the last one is less than. Examples. Mathematical translate phrases into each verbal phrases. Twice a number x added to 10. It's like this, 2x plus 10. A number n decreased by 5 is equal to n minus 5. A number n multiplied by 7 is equal to 7y. Twice a number a divided by 3, or a divided by 3, is 2a over 3. 4 times a number x minus 4 is equal to 5x minus 4. Trieth, the sum of a number, x and 6, is equal to 3, open parenthesis, x plus 6, close parenthesis. A number x is divided by 2 added to 7 is equal to 7 plus x over 2. Now, let algebraic symbols translate into mathematical statement. 2x plus y can be stated as either twice the sum of x and y or 2 times x increased by y. It can also be and more than twice x. x exceeds by twice y. x minus 3y can be read as x minus twice y or tries and subtracted from x. It can also be 3 times y less than x, or x diminished by trice y. 5x plus 2y. The product of 5x added to the product of 2 and y, or the sum of 5 times x and 2 times y. It can also be 5 times x increase by twice y, or twice and more than 5 times x. x over y minus 2z. 
the quotient of x and y decrease by twice z, or x divided by y less than twice z, it can also be twice z less than the quotient of x and y, or the difference between the quotient of x and y and twice z. Formulas are equations that state relationship between quantities. These formulas can be translated into verbal sentences. Let us try. A is equal to LW will be the area of a rectangle is the product of the length and the width of the triangle. P is equal to 2L plus 2W. The perimeter of a rectangle is the sum of twice its length and twice its width. D is equals RT. The distance traveled by a moving body is the product of rate and time. I hope these useful tips will help you a lot in solving world problems in algebra. Now let's try. Translate into verbal phrases. You may comment down your answer below, or also post this video so you can check the given questions. Next, translate in algebraic symbols. You may post this video to see and check it out the questions below. You can also post your answer or comment down. Learning from home can be difficult, but it's definitely achievable. Thank you very much for listening. See you next time.